Okay, I have a question for all three of you, and all of you. How many of you are afraid of the dark? Okay. You raised your hand. Okay, all right, I appreciate that. How many of you were afraid of the dark? Okay, right? Now, you were afraid of the dark. What did you do? I know. Run to your mommy. Exactly. That's what I did. But also, lights. Micah, you may have something like this in your room. It's a night light right here. See? We all have these in our hallway at night because I am famous for stepping on toys and cats and also famous for yelling and screaming in pain. So this is why we have that. You look like a responsible young man. You want to hold this? Maybe around with it? Yeah, that's another kind of light that we have. That one we use when there's a power outage it's at night because it's powerful lights. Of course, we have candles. Like we have these wonderful candles. A flashlight. Now I learned at the nine o'clock service not to flash this in my eyes because this thing is. Oh, I did it again. <laughs> it's a very But what do lights do? Well, they help us see and walk in the dark. That's what candles do, and it's what night lights do. Now today we hear about another light, and this light is a person. And guess who I'm going to talk about? Jesus. Very good. Exactly. Right. <laughs> Micah, you are just, you're, you've got that booming voice. Davis, you do too. Now, I want you to think for a minute and look at this cross and think about Jesus. Think about Jesus as a flashlight, a nightlight, a candle, because he too helps us see in the dark. He too helps us walk in the dark. And when we are in the dark, it could be like a dark room. When we get scared, remember that Jesus is with us. And also, there's another kind of dark, and that's when we're feeling sad and lonely. Jesus is in that dark with us as well. Because Jesus loves all of us. And Jesus will protect us. And he's going to make you brave and strong. Now, for those of you and those of us who used to be afraid of the dark. Now we're all strong and brave when it comes to the dark. Well, most of the time, right? Well, Jesus too makes us strong and brave. And so what I want us to do is think about how we can also be a light, be a light to people who need someone to walk with them or lead them when they're in the dark, just like Jesus did us. So when you think of Jesus, think of the light and then be the light for others. Okay? Will you please pray with me? Repeat after me. Dear Jesus, thank you for being the light. Thank you for being our light. Make us brave and certain that you are with us in the dark and in the light. Amen. And I will take that light you did so well keeping guard of that put this right here and can we do like a little little bitty little bitty here davis here can you fist bump right here right on the count of three you ready to say peeps one two three peep okay good job there we go awesome. thank you brother